nice. This is the Peak Design Travel Tripod. If you look anywhere on YouTube, pretty much all you're gonna see are the carbon fiber versions. I just got the aluminum, because the extra $250 for the carbon fiber, as, oh, it's so tempting. I really wanted that one, but I need so much equipment right now. I feel like that 250 could be better spent on the other equipment I need. Looking good. Slick. Look at that, that is, that's my arm. That is nothing. These straps right here are fantastic for um, securing this bag to the side of your bag. I can't get over how excited I am right now. That's super tiny. Well, we've got our tool right here. Pop the clip off. So we got our hex wrench, smaller hex wrench, and you can use the other side as your leverage to twist. You can clip it onto any leg, I guess. And then when you close it up, boom, nice and flush. This clip is so satisfying. It's got really good spring pressure. It just feels solid. Wow. And then you've got your lock feature right here so that this clip can't go down. So that is secure. I'm not worried about that at all. When you're done loosening and tightening, it just, I could do that all day. It feels substantial, but it's very light. So they've included this hook on the bottom. You can hang your backpack. So this will kind of even be nice to keep my bag off the ground. It gets so dirty. So you got a locking mechanism here. You pull that and it allows you to rotate. Now the hook also has a magnetic feature. So it's like a three-way safety feature for this little piece. Good enough magnet for what it's using, absolutely. It doesn't feel too weak. You don't have to really yank at it at all. The magnet piece that it's actually connected to, it also has a magnet and a spring. Works well. Gotta give it a little bit of a tug. Pull that out, put this back in. This feature is for your phone. So what you would do for this, ideally, take your camera plate off, you lock that in, and this clip comes over, there's an edge right here that kind of meets the top of this bracket, I guess you call. And then this clip comes right on top of both pieces, which will actually prevent this from coming forward. And then the tension on this is just, it's really strong. Very stable. Yeah, I mean, that's strong enough you can even clip on the side. You don't have to worry about it being centered perfectly. It's just intuitive and it works. I'll show the legs when we're on our shoot. Very obviously sturdy. All the legs come out, come back in, super smooth. And then when you're here, you can just push all the way back down, it snaps into place. I mean, that kind of covers the basics. Let's take this out in the field and see how it does. This is pretty compact, sort of, but Look at this, no head, no adjustments, just two links, that's it, that's all you got. Do you guys ever remember the, uh, the air gun? It was like, it, it just had kind of this function on the back, you pull it back and you shoot and it would just shoot kind of a ball of air through, through the air. These are literally the lights that I shoot with right now. And I, I mean, they work fine. <laughs> so you definitely don't need the Aperture 120D for some okay video lighting. Now this is the speed light clamp that I just got. You put your light kind of right here, clamp it down with this, hold it in place. The back of the light kind of comes out here where you can adjust the settings. Um, and then the umbrella, the rod goes through here, mounts to this. And uh, there you go. Since the speed lights are battery powered, you have a totally mobile, very light, controlled source of light. And there it is, uh, I'm all packed up. Let's see, we got camera bag, tripod. Now I can use this as the um, kind of B-roll tripod and uh, the umbrella, speed light mount. And uh, now we're ready to go. <laughs> Look, wave. 
tapped in. Lately, my life had a fast man, but it's ass plan. Fight for my life with the brass hands. What's up, dude? We're making a new vlog today. This place is kind of crazy. Push start, type of dance cool, but the tent plan. I'm back on my bending rolls for the kicks. They quit to give them two cents, but my son's like a good one. I just got a mask. If you guys need a mask, I'm gonna put a link for this person who's making awesome masks. <laughs> I can't smile to the camera now. Just smile with your eyes. Okay, so, um, should we tell them about yesterday? The... Uh, yes? Yes. Yes. This is part of it, I guess. Yeah, this is actually day two. We were all running late, and by the time we got to the location yesterday, it was already kind of too dark. So, instead of showing off the tripod and playing with that, we actually used my new light setup. So, there's a couple shots. Let's look at that. Um, we also don't have Eric now for the rest of this content, but we traded in for Ryan. So, uh, Ryan's helping us out with some behind the scenes stuff. Um, we're gonna head over back to the same location, same sort of goals, and um, see what we can cook up. Okay, in these days I get replays, blue faces, how I decorated the loose page. Remember how I used to serve the plate, clean the food tray, working eight to four from Tuesday through the weekdays. Hustle evenings at the stoop off Highway 92 in Haywood, always running just a few late, talking a new game. Back to the crib and I color in new ways. Roll to the new blade, but the budget tied me down like shoe strings. Collected the loose change, those were the days that made me. She on my line like a beacon. She could have swore that I was cheating. She, to be honest, I was barely breathing. Chasing the life how I wanted it, knowing it's you was all that I need. Puzzled that all of the pieces that fit like a glove, you sit it right in front of me. How I don't see it. Hit up the Brody to fit, like thought that's I take it easy. Am I young or something? No, am I reaching to be validated instead of get told from the parking space? Why do it feel like I can have a vote for the ominous faces to all that won't save us? I thought the ground was for the breaking. Look like it's all overrated. Yeah, like it's all overrated. Look like it's all overrated to me. Like it's all overrated to me. Can't get no sleep, living in the weeks. Life is pretty sweet, I can't really explain it, but it's everything I need. At least for now, I think that everything might be alright, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. I can't get no sleep, living in the weeks. Life is pretty sweet, I can't really explain it. Alright, we're having a blast, having fun. Um, I'm gonna have Giovanna, our model, bust out this tripod so you can kind of see how easily and quickly it breaks down, and uh, then we're gonna keep shooting. Photographer, what do you think of this tripod so far? Uh, it's awesome because it's light. It's actually surprisingly light. But is it sturdy? Super sturdy. Light and sturdy. The things you need. Now what we're gonna do is uh, use the tripod. Um, we're gonna set up in the same sh spot that we shot last night, but this time we're going to do a composite. So we're gonna make mini models of the same model in one photo, and you can see us do that now. Now we are going to, God, this is so light. All right, we're gonna set this up and shoot our main shot with nobody in it, our control shot, and then shoot our different poses that we're gonna composite in after that. Going by. We're gonna try and shoot one more location and then call it a wrap. <laughs> 